This is Dread Magus X1. I'm coming to you from Minecraft. I'm actually going to be dabbling in this for a while. It's a uh, Minecraft Infinity, uh, FTB Infinity. Um, I played this before. I never really played. You know, I play. I didn't play this game, this uh, pack by myself, and I always had like others to play with on a server. But this is going to be just me and maybe a couple others. Um, and I'm going to be trying to do my own thing so I actually can try to play the game and, you know, learn some of the mods and get reacquainted re with Minecraft since it's such a great game and all these mods that just make it so much awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So I just want to just uh, start off by, I actually started digging down, um, well, hold on. Let's start off by showing that I found a village not too far away from where, um, you know, I traveled a little bit, and then um, I found a village, so I decided to, like, make a home here. What I plan to do is, <laughs> you can see I raided it already. I raided most of this. What I'm going to do is completely destroy all the houses and get rid of everything. It's a pretty de it's a small little town, but it's gated, and that's what I really wanted to do. That I was excited about. And this is my home for right now. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to end up... Um, I'm going to end up, you know, living here for a little bit, mining until I get diamonds and and gearing up for stuff like that and just trying to push the limits of what I know with for these mods. I'm not going to use any wikis. I'm just going to use all in-game stuff. And maybe if I get stuck, really stuck on somewhere, I might ask a, a good friend, Titan Blade. Um, he, he'll know most of the stuff. Um, so it'll probably be just me and me and Titan Blade for, but for right now it's just me. Oh, I went back up here to grab some food. Let me go grab some food. Yeah, so I actually been playing Minecraft since uh, Minecraft 1.2.4 or 1.2.5. I'm not sure. It's one of them. Let's see. If I got more food. Man, I gotta cook some. Uh, I'm burning more wood. I think that should do it. I just uh, really like some of these mods. Yeah, I made I made a glider, which is a really, really useful tool in the beginning for scouting off ahead and, you know, looking around. Uh, just to give you a little idea how far I travel. I didn't really far travel far. I started, like, right around in this area right here. And then I just walked my way down, and then I seen this on the, on the map, and I decided to make this home. Um, so yeah, this is going to be interesting. I can't wait to see what's the ending. Hey, oh. I'll also put the rest of the meat in there. And drop it like this. I'm going to need a new chest. So I am unfamiliar with some of these mods, but I do know some things. Um, I started messing around with uh, forestry bees, and I'm really interested in it. It's really cool how, how it's all set up. Let's get this stuff out of the way. I wonder if I can burn this. So I don't have to keep using coal. Um, let's see. Can I put this in there? Yes, you can. As far as the fence goes. I'll take... I'll just put the rest of the stuff in here so I don't die with it on me. The table stays. Keep half the wood there, too. Um, yeah, I just wanted to, uh, you know, I'm just trying to play the game and still kind of get rekindled. I do know how to use Tinker's Construct. It's the most coolest modular mod you can possibly imagine. Um, most of you that are familiar with mod pet mods, you'd already know what Tinker's Construct is. It's one of the mods that like you can't live without. Um, it's just one of the mods that it has to be in every single pack you play, or it just doesn't feel right, depending on how it is. Oh, what's this?
try to make a, a mine shaft to go down so I can use, at least use the uh, technique of strip mining. And I think I just see diamond there. Let me make sure because it is diamond. Yes, let's see if I can mine it. Can I mine it? Yes! Oh, one diamond. Yes, I got... It's, a, it's an actual diamond. It's a diamond. Yes, I got my first diamond. It's only been like less than 10 minutes of the game. So that is actually going to help me a very lot in my endeavor of finding items and looting, you know, the surrounding area. Um, this looks like it's really dark in here. I'm going to try to light it up so I can actually explore it. Uh, hey, that's, that's iron. I need iron. Um, yeah, so it's just one of them things. I'm just gonna keep, keep trying to push myself to with my Minecraft knowledge because I'm, I'm new to most of the mods, but some of them are very familiar. I used to play them back in, in one, one, one two five. Um, so it's just one of them things. I, I just gotta, I want to get reacquainted. I used to be really big in Buildcraft, which I think Buildcraft is in this one. Let me check. Oh yeah, Buildcraft is in this, so that's going to be awesome. Uh, you know, the pipe idea and stuff like that. It was one of my favorite parts of uh, actually learning Minecraft and getting into it. So I just want to be, um, I just want to, you know, I just want to get into the how, how I felt my when I beginning of, uh, started to play Minecraft was, like my first experience. And these guys that developed this pack are amazing people to put such a, a pretty good... Um, pack together. And it's been fun. I've been playing this uh, for a couple days now, just just getting used to it and, and you know just messing around. But this is an actual new server. I wanted to get it into a little bit. This is like kind of like my first time without playing with people that know way too much. Because you know, if you get a good group of people, you go can whiz through this so fast. It's unbelievable how fast that. A good group of people that know what they're doing will just tank right through this and it's unfortunate it goes that way but it's still cool but you know like power systems I know there's power systems I remember seeing a couple buddies of mine making them so it's just one of them things like I I just want to kind of play solo-ish but you know with a couple people that are new as well like myself when it comes to it so that way I can actually learn them instead of just feel like I'm just mining the whole time and giving resources. I want to actually contribute to a little group that we have, I have going on. Um, so yeah, like, you know, I like to, you know, just make sure that, you know, everybody knows that I appreciate how, how fast you guys are at Minecraft, but sometimes I just want to learn things on my own. Um, it's just one of them things. Um, so this is the, the uh, going to be like the streaming server for me and a few others, like I stated before. Um, I'm gonna just grab this because it's gonna be useful. Uh -oh. Alright. So yeah, this is gonna be a really fun time. I just wanna have some fun and 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 have some adventures and like have some like end goals and like you know try to get where I need to be and still explore and explore and just adventure and actually kill the <laughs> end dragon. I've never actually killed the dragon. As many times as I've played this game and, and enjoyed it, I've never actually killed, I have never even killed the Wither, Wither or the Dragon, so this is going to be experience. I want to captivate this on stream as I'm killing the Dragon for my first time. And I heard there's a really cool, like, credits things, and it just gets really bizarre um, from, like, various other sources that I've looked at, but I actually am really excited about playing trying to get there but I know I'm not gonna get there anytime soon because I want to take my time and get like some double or processing and maybe some like um, I don't know yet I don't really know what what to ex what, what am I gonna expect you know this is just one of them things I just want to play the game see how far I can get and enjoy the little time uh, the time that I have actually streaming um, 
which is not very often. I, I try to generally stream as much as I can, but you know, a house full of people, it's very hard to stream when there's background noise and yelling and, you know, my nieces and nephews yelling at me to go play like Minecraft on the, uh, on the Xbox with them or playing Diablo with them. Cause that's another game I play too. I, I play a vi wide variety of games. But yeah, I actually am um, waiting for a buddy of Titan to show up. He hasn't showed up yet, so I'm going to head back up. I'm going to put some stairs down. I should have enough cobble to make some stairs for this lovely huh. mine shaft slash whatever this is supposed to be. Alright, let's, uh, let's get some sleeping going on. It's a change of day. Huh. Huh. Let's um, get some stairs. Let's, let's, let's fix this. Put that one diamond on there so that way I can mine obsidian. That's a step right there. Um, and put some of this on there. I probably just that, but it's all good. Oh, the reason why you see like it says a reinforced three, I found a part uh, uh, that filled this mine that allows you to add like, you know various different mechanics to it, and I found it, and I decided to put it on it, and it gave me reinforced on the hammer. I'm not really sure what reinforced does. Um. Not really sure. But yeah. Oh, what I'm doing right here is getting a bonus to my mining speed to make it fast, the pickaxe faster than I mine. I can only go to 50, so that means I'm going to need more of this material. Yeah, so uh, I'm just really excited. I'm just really excited, and I'm actually really excited to see this uh, work, you know. I'm willing to put in the time and, 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 and make the little things that we do, that we do in this game, like, a, a realistic thing, like tearing down the place, rebuilding our little town, making an actual town, and filling it in with really good people that I actually can say are part of my community, we work together as a team, and everybody's fine, because no one likes to have come on a server where you spend like six hours on it, and then for some jerk to come up here and just say, oh yeah, well, blowing it up or PvP you for no reason. That's not what I'm about. I like to play in environments where if PvP is in a zone, and then you say, hey, let's go PvP, and we'll put some items up for grabs. Yeah, we can do that. We can do like a better ring or, or whatever. You know what I mean? I just want to have some fun playing this game. So yeah, let's see. I'm gonna. I know a little bit. Let's see. That's not the one I needed. That's oh, it's because it's called the quartz grinder. I need stones. Stones. So need this. I definitely need that. Oh no, I just need some of this. And three of them. And we some. I at least I at least want to make a bucket because I don't have farmland set up, and uh, yeah, I kind of do the farm thing. Miles just put the iron in there because you don't know what you're gonna need. So it's kind of one of those things. It's like. Let's just put that. Let's see what this guy's got. That is rip off, so I'm gonna kill you. That's horrible, but I had to. So yeah, th um, that would be cool. I can use this as a modifier. I can't though. Yo, a modifier on a uh, you know. Tinker's Construct thing. That would be so awesome to see. Let's get some of that out. Let's get this grinder going so that way I can 
find a way. God. The basic level of grindy grindness. I think that's right. Let's see. Let's put the grinder uh, right there. And we'll take um, we'll take some of this iron. I need definitely need iron first. Iron. Gold. I don't think I can grind that up, but uh, I'm gonna leave it there. So let's just grind a little bit of this up. I know this is really tedious and 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 grinding it this way, but I actually think it's pretty cool how uh, how far Minecraft has came come in such the and so long in like the mods and the very creative people that actually are keeping this modding community together with mods that are just amazing. Um, I just can't express enough like this game is fun as it is but mods just make this game crazy and fun and everybody that knows that there's certain mods that people cannot play without and this is one of this is one of them for me like um well not uh well applied energy six is a fun mod i never actually get into it but i know that this is this is what i usually make to start off to get my double xors right away because it's the most simplest thing to make and it's the most efficient right from the start um, you know stuff like that and this little thing right here makes a di big difference when you're trying to make full sets of armor you know a little bit of things stuff like that especially early game because this i'm way early game i had even i have no armor on i have no armor on my skin is a little weird so yeah so it's just one of them things like i really enjoy this mod uh, pack um, I got a, a friend introduced me to it so it's kind of one of the things so it's like hmm should I play and give Minecraft another chance and I said yeah because it's just one of them games that you can always fall back onto this game sometimes it can be very frustrating but we always fall back on this game and you know I just love it it's just one of the games I love and enjoy I don't know if it either is the mining or just like how how much stuff you can actually do in such a simple game that was created by a genius just saying. Oh, gold is almost done too. So this, I'm gonna do this for a little bit longer. Oh, this is so tedious. Sorry guys, this is very tedious, but I need to get this done. I think a bucket should be priority for farmland. Um, then I'm gonna try to excavate like the landscape around me, so I can get, you know, start building and. Uh, getting rid of all these houses and maybe kill all the villagers because <laughs> hearing them makes me want to it's driving me nuts by the way look at them see them and now there's some green green thing out there what the heck is that it's not hostile I hope oh gosh it's coming I think I'm gonna two more pieces left Please don't let it don't let it come in my house. It's gonna kill me. It's gonna kill me. Don't let it kill me. Yeah. So this has actually been a really cool experience. Oh, okay, that's done. Right, let's get that. Let's get that. Oh, okay. What are you doing? What are you doing in my house? You don't sell anything good. Get out. That's right. Oh, let's get let's get another furnace going. Oh, I already had some. One, two, three. One, two, three. Let's uh, while well, that's brewing up. Uh, down in inside there. I think I'm going to go back mining. And uh, get rid of these books. I don't need that just yet. Actually, you know what? I think I'm going to clear this area out right here. Um, so 
that's where it's not attacking. Me. It's not. What the heck? Killed it. All right, let's get rid of this. Thing. Let's just get rid of this. Everything in this game can be used for something, which is really awesome. Well, just about everything. At least vanilla-wise, it's you. You use. You can use it. Uh, even the, some of the modded stuff can be used for various different things. I think it's getting dark out, so I'm gonna try to um, hurry as fast as I can. Once I take this down. Sorry about that. another feature that's from Tinker's Construct. Stone torches. So you don't have to use wood. Let's light up this area. At least where I live. Or right here. This. Oh, they're all dropped in there. sleep. For some reason that my map is turning purple, which is really cool. It turns purple, then it doesn't. I don't get it. But it works, though. Alright, let's make that bucket. I know I didn't make that bucket. Any eyes a lifesaver. Oh. That's why I wanted to. Um. Something just died, a zombie. Zombie just currently died out the window. <laughs> 